Sony Computer Entertainment America presents a Universal Interactive Studios production. A game created and developed by Naughty Dog. What's up, everyone? This is Jemaya from Chapter 35, and this is Crash Bandicoot Chris. War! Alright, well, let's start it off. And today we're going to be, uh, yeah. So why this game? Well, I'll tell you about that in, after the cutscene. Uka, Uka is free. No, it cannot be. Evil, great evil has come. None dare to fail the great Uka, Uka, even once. But you, Cortex, you have failed me twice. Great Uka, Uka, it was that infernal. Bandicoot! From deep inside my temple prison, I sent you simple instructions to follow. But you lost the gems, you lost the crystals, and I have lost my patience! There is now no other power source left on this planet. I know, we've had a few unfortunate setbacks and failed. But since your bumbling has managed to set me free, I am feeling generous. There is still a way for us to amass the power needed to enslave this miserable planet. And this time, this time the great Uka Uka will make sure that you do it right. After many eons, my evil twin, Uka Uka Uka, has been freed from his underground prison. Long ago, I locked him there to protect the world from his malice. Now, free once again, he must be stopped. <laughs> Children, Uka Uka and Cortex plan to use this time-twisting machine to gather crystals that lay scattered across time. I have brought you here to recover the crystals before they do so. To open the time portal, simply stand on a button and then jump into the portal. Good luck. All right. So... The reason why I decided this game instead of um, any other games in general is because, well, it's a Crash Bandicoot hype. And <laughs> it is a really big hype. We get to see Crash Bandicoot 1, 2, and 3 remastered. Man, it's been a long time ever since I played this game. But you might be wondering, but Jeremiah, uh, why won't you wait until you get a PlayStation 4? Well, that's um, or play it on the PlayStation 4 to be exact. Well, that's because I don't have a PlayStation 4. <laughs> I don't exactly have it right now to uh, currently. And also, you might be wondering, well, why not play on the PlayStation 3? Well, I could if I have a special game capture card to record PlayStation 3 games. That and, well, money. So we're gonna play on the emulator for now. And I'm sorry for bad graphics error. Um, this is, uh, for now my computer don't have the best graphics per se, but the emulator makes the game really good, by the way, cutscene. Crash, 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 why must you always muck in my mud? Oh, look, I have a mask helping me, too. 
We will find out which one is more powerful soon enough. All right. So we're going to be going to Toad Village, and we're going to have a lot of fun. But until then, um, until I get a new graphics card, it's going to be like this for a while. So, yeah. So how is everybody doing today? I'm pretty sure everybody's doing great thus far. Oh. Um, I'm guessing you're wondering, how did I get this, uh, Emily? Well, it's all thanks to my brother, who also has his own, uh, YouTube channel. I'll place it down in the link in the description down below to check it out. As well as the other video, uh, YouTube channel that he collabed with, too. Uh, Angry... The Angry Cow? Uh, 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 anyways. Um, <clears throat> I'll place those two links down in the description down below and check those guys out. It's really awesome to see it. Uh, so, right now we are in a <laughs> medieval time and we have a mask. Uh, okay, so quick thing about this game. You spin, you jump, and you crawl. But there's a catch. You see, Akua Aku, the mask guy you see over, over my head, is kind of like a life support. A single hit from the enemy, and well, I will lose that mask. If I don't have the mask with me at all, I will die. I just like to kill those enemies, by the way. Um, so, what we're doing is just doing, uh, collecting the purple crystals for the time being. And if I have enough spare time, I might be able to do others like relics and the gems, too. But for now, I'm collecting the purple crystals. Or power crystals. Um, it's been a long while since I played Crash Bandicoot, but the memory still lives. So, <laughs> I remember ever since I was young, I used to play Crash Bandicoot 3 War. Me and my brother were terrible at it. <laughs> but now we are actually getting pretty good. In fact, I'm getting pretty good at this as well, since I have. A well, <laughs> control stick instead of the directional pad. Man, how the times have changed. So, you might be wondering, uh, well, what am I playing on? Well, I'm actually playing on the emulator, a uh, PlayStation 2 emulator to be exact. Maybe I could use an emulator to record my games on my uh, PC. I don't know. The emulator is going pretty good. I'm sorry for uh, some of the slowdowns. Again, my computer don't have the best graphics card, so for now this will have to do. But uh, once I get a new graphics card, everything will change. So just keep on walking forward. I will really like this game a lot. <laughs> Oh, Bonnie's land. Alright, so we wait until that guy spins and go collect that purple crystal. I, I always try to uh, keep the mask on me at all times so that once I collect the third one, I will be invisible. Like when Super Sonic. Okay. All right. Just to make your, um, just to be clear, I'm just only trying to collect all the the power crystals. I'm not going to be collecting all the gems. But if I ever want to collect the gems, or if I manage to collect the gems, then that is great. But for now, we're actually going to be doing half all the levels, which means. One, two, and three. So that way, 
we will have an equal amount of levels to be done. And now we're doing, oh, great, under pressure. No pressure. <laughs> this is um, an underwater level, if you don't know. So, what we're doing here is we're swimming under the sea. Under the sea! Under the sea! Rolling and sweeping, it's great to take it from me! Okay, and we still do the same thing. No, I always want. Oh! As you see there, I got it. Um, the mask, which was golden, suddenly turns back to normal. Okay, now we have to be careful here. Mainly because, well, not because of. Uh, going up, going down. All right, going all around. But uh, what do you think about Crash Bandicoot? Uh, do you think it's an awesome series? Place your comments down below. Well, I, of course, it's awesome. Crash Bandicoot is the best platformer for PlayStation. I just really wish that they would go back to good old days sometimes. As much as I like the newer games like uh, Ratchet Jig, Clank, um, Uncharted, Crash, Crash is my man. Alright, now we're in this vehicle in which we are able to shoot missiles to catch this we don't want to get hit. Why? Well, mainly because if we get hit, we'll lose the chance of getting the gems. Which, again, I'm not going to be trying to aim to get all the gems. But if that were the case, and I managed to get them quickly, then that's actually pretty cool. But Alright, now we're going to swim up. And go in. Oh yeah, it they get destroyed if they if you try to go in. And we're gonna get the checkpoints. One thing I like about this game is that all your uh, boxes that you collected are automatically saved after you hit the checkpoint, so that's awesome. Okay. Oh! Okay, that was... that was bad. Uh, that was very, very bad. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, I'm actually, I'm going to actually get going so uh, better. <laughs> so far, so good. Now, we dance. Nostalgia. Alright, now we're going to the final level, which, oh. Oh, well. So we're going to be playing as Coco, which is actually brand new to the series. She first appeared in Crash Bandicoot 2, yeah, but this is her first ever time to be playable. The second time to be playable was, I believe, Wrath of Cortex, 
Ah, I missed a box. Oh my. Oh, I missed another box. Uh, I'm not going to be trying to collect all the gems here. This is the hardest one to collect all the gems. Um, I keep on missing those boxes. I don't know why. Alright, so um, what we do here is we just try to avoid all the obstacles as best we can. Bent all the boxes. Collect wampa fruits. You know, the usual. And yeah. If I ever uh Oh, yikes. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Checkpoint. Okay, now that's nice. Alright, I like those boxes. This is all the up to me! Okay, I fail. I feel so hard. <laughs> ah, missed one. I really can't wait until I get a new graphics card. On my old computer, it looks so much. <sighs> Seriously, I didn't have so much problem beforehand. Why am I having so much trouble? No. Oh! I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. All right. Okay. There we go. There we go. So as I was uh, saying, what so I get? Uh, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, this part. Um, th this is not her only uh gameplay style. Um. But you see, uh, if you um, go to other levels, there's also a jet ski and also an airplane. Which Crash also appears in the airplane one, and we finally finish it. There are now 51. Man, so close, too. So, that's all. That's all, folks! Well, that's what's new. Uh, so that's about it. So, <laughs> bye, Coco. So this is Jermaine from Jamfrap35. If you like the video, please place a like, comment, and subscribe. I'm sorry for all the unfinished graphics here and there, but once I knew it, you get a new graphics card, I promise you, it will look a lot more better as it appeared on my computer. So this is Jermaine from Jamfrap35. Like and subscribe for more videos to come, and of course, have a good time. Have a good time. There we go. <laughs> Alright. Bye everyone, and take care. I'm out of here.